wake up I feel cozy, yeah Can you hold up? Don't need no coffee, yeah Hey peeps, how y'all doing? Today is Everything Adopt Me and there is new accessories, pet wear in the game and it's not just new, it is an update. There's a Royal Butterfly Game Pass, but check this out first. If you go under servers, I've always had a private server, but it shows payment canceled and I was like, what? And then I was like, oh, it shows up here price free. So the payment is canceled because it is now free. Everybody can go into Adopt Me and get their own private server and play with your friends without everybody else. So the private servers are now free and that is it. So now we are going to go into the game and check out this Royal Butterfly Game Pass. Also today I am going to show you guys some um, outfits that I would choose if I was getting my outfits in the Adopt Me catalog. There are a bunch and I love them. So we're going to teleport over now to the hat shop so we can check out this new Royal Butterfly bundle. It's beautiful. I'm loving the tiara and we're going to first try it on the Golden Unicorn. So it looks like it's 80 Robux, which is actually a really good deal if you have Robux to go in and purchase it. That's not a bad price for this Game Pass because you're actually getting a lot. You're getting the tiara, you're getting the glasses, you're getting the wings, and you're getting the pink shoes. And let me tell you, the pink shoes and the tiara is everything for me. I do love the wings and the glasses, but those two are my favorite. So it looks like they are ultra rare. The shoes and the wings are ultra rare and it's darling. It even looks good with the other wings that we have here in the game. So we're going to scroll down and see where is this tiara, you guys. There it is. Okay, so wait. I just passed it. Let me go back up. I'm trying to find the glasses are right beside the tiara. It says uncommon. That's really throwing me off. I wonder why the tiara is uncommon. Is that right? whatever let's move on it looks so cute i love the pink high tops i can't even stand it so it basically changes the feet out completely and puts shoes on your pet so i'm anxious to see what it's going to look like with the pets that only have two feet and then the pets that have four feet and then the pets that have no feet like the starfish okay so this is going to be fun Let's change out a pet and see what it looks like. Oh my god, look when you hold it, it's just shaking its little shoes. I love it. Okay, so now we're going to try with Mr. Biggie, the golden penguin, and see what it looks like with the pets that like walk on their feet, standing up like we do. How a darling is that? Oh my gosh, that is so stinking cute. I love it. Now let's try the albino bean. I have a feeling this is going to be quite interesting. Look at that. Oh my goodness, they did such a good job with this update. Like seriously, to have to custom it to every single pet that is in the game, that has to be a lot of work. That is so cute on the albino. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm instantly loving, oh my goodness, look at this baby. The way that the legs are placed when you're holding the albino with the shoes on is dope. <laughs> like, I just wanna walk around and carry a bean all day now. That is darling. I'm suddenly loving all my pets with the shoes and yes, I'm super happy. What a great update that this is. giraffe one of my favorite pets in the game that looks really good <laughs> okay banana split it's your time to shine let's go on the catwalk yes you look good I know you feel good in your new shoes oh that is darling I love it okay I've had my fun I need to check out the other accessories too but we're gonna check out these pride pins now because they are free 
Okay, so when you hover over them, it tells you exactly which pin that it is, and you can take whichever one that you choose, and it says once every hour. So every hour you can go and collect one of the free pins, and they are to be worn on your pets. So there's trans pride and gay pride and envy pride and I don't even know if I said that right, but there's bi pride and so many different ones. There is one that I was looking for which is the alley, which means that you um, support all of the groups but you um, don't represent them. So I'm just going to try one just because I want to see what it looks like. Um, but I would hope that they will add the alley pen for all of us that are supportive, um, but don't represent it as our, for ourselves. <clears throat> but yeah, they're really cool, and the fact that they're free is amazing. And yes, I support every person, no matter who or what or anything. Everybody is amazing, and I love all of you guys. Okay, so let's check out those prescription glasses. Those are cool. I like those. 100 AMC. And they're common. Okay, and then we have the brown cozy hood, the red sneakers. I'm all about color. So if it's a color I like, ooh, black high tops. I like those, but 1500, dang, that's a lot. And the cassette is cool, and the hat and earrings, of course, I gotta get those hoop earrings. That is just a no-brainer for me. I have just enough to get the hoop earrings, and I'm gonna buy those right now. And then it goes back over to start back at the beginning. So, yes, we got the earrings. Let's go see what they have up here on the throne. It has to be those shoes, yeah. So, the black high tops are just like the pink ones, and they are expensive. So I definitely want to get those when I get some AMC, but I always spend my AMC, so I don't have enough to get it right now. Very, very cute. Let's try these earrings out because those are look like the earrings that I have in real life. I think they're going to look good on all the pets, but I gravitate towards the golden unicorn usually first just to see. So let's get a close up of your ears so we can check it out. Aww. She be styling, she be styling, oh yeah. And then I just got an idea that I think it would be really funny to see what it looks like on the shadow dragon. I just got a shadow dragon recently. I want to have one for my collection. They are huge and big and black and like bony and everything so it's never been a favorite of mine but I definitely wanted to have one and so now that we have pink shoes a tiara and some earrings maybe I like it a little bit more I'm not saying I don't like the pet I'm just saying it's really big for me anyways it looks kind of funny though oh my gosh it kind of looks like um I don't know like a creepy grandpa anyways and I love my grandpa rest in peace but yes okay so <laughs> I don't know let's take some of this off and see what it looks like yeah so here's what I came up with what do you guys think you guys like the new update you think it's cool you think it's lame you love it I love it and the pink flamingo okay how darling is that oh my god with the two little pink shoes oh it just looks so beautiful I never really appreciated it as much as I do in this moment. Oh, look with the wings, the shoes, everything. Oh my gosh. Okay, I think I'm having a new favorite pet in this moment, which is the pink flamingo because that is just so stinking cute. I love the tiara on it. I think that is darling. Yes, 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 yes. I wanted to put a screenshot in here of the starfish because I lost that footage, but look at this. When you put on the shoes on the starfish, it puts it on top like a hat. So even though they said that the shoe hat wasn't available, look what they decided to do. That is so cute. Yeah, but I'm really digging Pinky over here right now. She's looking so happy in my arms. I don't even want to let her go. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, so another thing that I'm going to do for this video is I'm going to do dressing up my avatar using the Adopt Me um, outfits. I had 
a viewer, which is Soft Ducks. Thank you for subscribing. She said, oh my God, yes, would you be able to do a video where you create on Adopt Me with only using Adopt Me clothes? Because I adore your outfits, and most of your outfits are your avatar and not an Adopt Me catalog. I don't have Robux, so I would love it if you would do that. And so I went in and responded to her and said, yes, I am going to do that. I'm doing it right now. And so we are going to go in and make a video. Thank you, Soft Ducks, for the request. And I appreciate everybody that's watching. And if you have any suggestions or anything for videos that you would like to see, just drop it in the comments like she did, and we will see what we can do about it. Let's go. Okay, so when I first started playing this game, there was many outfits that I chose from the catalog. I hope that they're still here, but it was before I started buying things with Roblox because I didn't really even know what I was doing when I first started playing Roblox. So anyways, what we're going to do is we are going to go in and take everything off that I have on my avatar currently and show you that we are starting from fresh in the game. I actually think that this tutu that I have is here in the waist items. It is here. So if you like it, it's here. You can wear it. So I'll just keep it on for now. What I like to do is I usually go into the general section. Although I just saw these pants under baby and I think that those are kind of cool. They look a little bit holographic, but I think that they're cute. I'll let you know like the reasons why I choose what I choose or don't choose what I choose. Don't choose. Um, I'm not really into white shoes. I love white shoes in real life, but sometimes if it's just like a basic all white on your foot in this game, and I like the boy leg because it's bigger. Um, then I don't really like just the plain white without any detail. These are kind of cute because they have the shoelaces. So anyways, it kind of booted me out of this server. I think a lot of people are in for the update, but I came back in. I'm in my house, but I still have the outfit on. So we're just going to go through and see different things that grab my eye. I always like a crop shirt because I don't like the shirts that go down to the very bottom of the waist because then it makes your body look longer than it actually should be. So I always choose a crop shirt. This outfit's pretty cute. I love anything that has like the short shorts or skirt and then with a higher either boot or tights or something like that or the bows on the leg. I always gravitate towards this because I think they are darling. So this pink Saint outfit is uh, really cute. I love it. I would even put like a little black tank top over it if it's a crop and still shows the belly area. That would be cute too. To um, if you didn't want to go around rocking the word saint. That's one of the only things that would have thrown me off from that is the word because I don't really need that on my chest. But it's a cute outfit. This one is cute. I love the legs. I love the ones that have a contrast in the legs. Like one side is all pink and then the other one is stripes. I love pink and white right now. So I hope that if you're watching that you like pink. Um, because I do. And when I say pink and white, I mean as far as the outfit, not the shoes. Unless they are something that is like a boots or tall boots or something like that. Anyways, you'll see what I'm talking about if you just follow me. Okay. I'm trying to see if there's a shirt that looks good with these pants. The problem with this outfit is that the white goes all the way to the neck. Okay, so this pink hoodie shirt is really darling. I love it. I would totally rock it with this outfit if it was winter. But it's summer, so we need to find a summer outfit. So that is what we're going to do now. Just scrolling down through the shirts just to see if there's really any shirts that I like. But I'm not seeing any. So unfortunately, I kind of like the black ones that are off the shoulder. I think that those are cute from this catalog. I definitely would rock those with different pants um, from here. So, and... I'll show you later the skirts. I did buy those. You can buy those with AMC, and those are kind of cute too, but I'm not going to put any of those outfits together. I'll just show you the ones that I have. Okay, so scrolling down through, let's see what it do. I'm going to speed it up for you. Okay, these jeans are cute. I'll just try on the things that pop out, and then I'll show you the outfits that I really love. So I would definitely rock these with like the off-the-shoulder black shirt, but it's not my first choice. 
and then let's see this I always love this outfit I wore it often whenever I uh, first started playing um, I don't really wear sneakers that often like I said I try not to wear things that have a name brand I don't know why there's really no reason um, but I just don't um, like Supreme or Adidas or Louis Vuitton or whatever um, but I do like these outfits like I remember this one Aww. yeah I love this one too it's really cute um, this one is okay but the shoes that's like that's the kind of white shoes that I don't like so I'm digging this outfit if it had different feet yeah and I know it's because I choose these legs but I like the bigger legs I don't like the really skinny legs because I don't have skinny skinny legs and then I don't like the boxy legs sometimes I like it with certain outfits but not all the time I love these legs all the time and um, this outfit is so cute yes the shoes are white but it looks good because it looks like knee highs or something like that so I would definitely wear that it's not the first choice but I like it Okay, this outfit's okay, and this is cute, but this is a fave. I definitely like this one. Um, it's perfect. It's pink, it's white. I'm, I'm not into cats so much, like the cat ears that's on the chest, but there's not really any shirts I would wear with it. I love this outfit. I think it's darling. I would totally wear it like every day. Yes, this is one of the best. Okay, let's get back to where we were. This is one I would choose for sure, and this one is so cute and so detailed. I love how it looks frilly, but it's really like a neutral pink color. Yeah, it matches everything. It looks good. I love it. It would look good with any hair. So yeah, this is definitely a favorite also. Very beautiful. Okay, I like this animation idol that's called Dress. Whenever you walk, kind of like a princess. Um, Maybe you don't like it, maybe you do. I love it. I think that it changes the way that you look, and I think it's really sweet and pretty, and especially if you have the speed lollipops where you can go fast, then it looks even cuter because you're walking like a princess and fast. So yeah, it's like a double whammy, really cool. Moving on. Okay, and I wanted to show you if you go into tails, um, I do have some of these tutus, but I think they're kind of too big and frilly. The only one that I really like to wear these days is the white one. I have the blue one and I have the black one, but I think that they're really like out there. Um, but this one is always cute. I love that it's high-waisted because it shows the leg. So yeah, that's a winner. Okay, let's go back in and see if there's anything else that's already highlighted two or three outfits that I really love. Um, you don't have to have too many as long as you have like a couple that you absolutely adore. I still like this one so much, I don't know why. Hmm, maybe if you had a necklace on or something that would break up the white part at the top and it's not even really that bad. So, so yeah, I like this one. I'm speeding it up and not losing the place so you can see where they are in the catalog, but I keep clicking on the same one so you can tell what I like. Yeah, I, it keeps going over the same ones. Oh my gosh, this one is cute. Okay, yeah, I found another fave. So this one that's right here beside the Gucci, it has the pink bows on the chest and the legs, and it's white. So white with the pink bows, love it. It looks good with the tutu. I want to see what it looks like with that. Oh my gosh, yes! Oh, it looks like a, like a little mermaid um, shorts, like little, I don't know, like the mermaid scales. It's so pretty. I love this outfit. Yeah, that is a winner also. Very beautiful. Oh my gosh, I'm having so much fun. Thank you for the suggestion. It's great. Okay, let's go sit through and see if there's anything else. But yeah, this one is really good. This one is cute, although it says Adidas, which is not something that I usually get. I would still wear it so anyways okay these are cute as I said I like the short shorts with the knee has or the over the knee but this oh my gosh if you're looking for an all summer just like Gucci shorts with a little halter top that's everything I love gray that's not everything um, I don't like red red is not my color and now I don't really want to wear that that's just not my style. No hate on anybody that wears the outfits that I'm not liking. This yellow is cute. If I like yellow, I like this outfit, but I don't want it for myself personally. And this is about the taste that I usually have and what I would wear and uh, showing you what is available for you. So yeah, this is a fave. 
I really love it. And I think we've almost reached the end, guys. I can't believe we're already at 30 minutes. This is crazy. But yeah, this one is really good. So there was like three or four that I really loved. And then there was a bunch that uh, were okay uh, to wear. And this is if you like black. I would definitely wear these. I'm not a kitty cat fan. I love dogs. I have a dog. I'm a dog fan. I don't have cats. I'm kind of scared of them. But this is still cute. There's still some things that are just too cute that I can't even ignore as far as the cats go with a Roblox catalog. But uh, with this, I would wear like a black halter like that. That's good. Um, or just one that's like off the shoulder like this. Yes, I love it. That's darling. I would totally rock it out. So I think uh, this one is okay. It's a little bit too stripey. Like this big stripes at the bottom then the little stripes at the top. I like this shirt if I just have plain black pants on or something like that. It's okay. And then there's like a panda shirt in here in this catalog that I used to always wear. I don't know why. I just always loved it. I think it was so adorable. There's probably old videos of me wearing it when I used to have like the little head on my avatar. When I first started I was I, I, it was my style, so I'm not even going to hate on myself for that, but anywho, yeah, off the shoulder black, I usually wear that more in the winter, I like the crop shirts, short shorts, knee high pants, and then I like the legs that are, have two different um, patterns on the legs, those are cool. Yeah, there's actually so many good options in here. I can't even lie. If you have any questions about it, just let me know. This is the panda shirt I'm talking about. Yeah, I love this panda shirt. I don't know why. I just think it's darling. I love that it says enjoy with the eye. The only problem there is it goes down past that waist thing that I was talking about. But other than that, it's definitely a favorite. Oh my gosh, this is so much fun. Yeah, so the skirts that I have, I do have the short blue one, the short green one, the long red one, the short, short, short yellow one. I love all those. Um, not really with these outfits, but I do love the skirts. I think they're fun to put outfits together with those also. Do you see that? At some point, my avatar changed. Like, I have the, the legs and the head that's not mine. Oh well, that's so funny. Well, that's kind of cool that it did that though, so I can show you which head I would use it because you can change your heads in the game. So I like the one that spreads the face out and so it's not like real tight into the middle of the face. It spreads your eyes and your lips out. So I'll show you that in a minute, but I still like this pants. I love this outfit. Like when they first got the swimming area, for some reason I always put this outfit on to go over to the pool area. I think that's like a perfect summer outfit no lie yeah i don't know why it changes your avatar like that sometimes but anyways it's cute i love the nose ring also i don't know if that's available in the catalog or not i have to check that out next time so anyways yeah it's got me running and looking um not like myself but it's cute i love it so if you go in under the um walking what I, I don't even know what it's called animations i like the dress and then the heads i like the the head that spreads your face out like that i know that you saw the difference if you didn't rewind it and watch it that's what the difference is i don't know what the name of the head is but that doesn't even matter moving on to the hairs i do have a lot of pink hair i have this ponytail um that is pink and black i think that that one is cool i didn't take my hair off yet but that's okay I don't have this bubblegum ponytail, but I like it. I think it's cute. It's kind of a little bit much, but I do like it. Um, let's see. I have this all pink side part here. That's by Suki. This high ponytail with the white bow. I have that. I love that one. Um, it doesn't look like the one that I have on is in here, so that's okay. We'll just take it off. And I like this blonde um, by Beism. She did like the French braids with the ponytail over your shoulders. That one is amazing. All of Beism's stuff is amazing, anyways. So, okay, scrolling through the blondes, I have this one and I think it's cute, but it's too glitchy. It has like lines, you can see the lines in it. So, unfortunately, it's a beautiful style. This one is pretty. That's the softer tone of the Bohemian Beach Braid. 
and it's cute, but I like the other version better. It's a more gritty look, so I'll try to see if I can find that and show you that one through here. I love all of these. That's like the Dragon Beats um, hair. It's from an anime. Anyways, it doesn't matter. I just love these hairs. I did a video about them before. And I'm so, I was so happy the day that they were all released. I love every color and I have them all. This is the one. I love this Bohemian Beach Braid by Beazin. She is amazing. All of her hair is amazing. I have a lot of hairs by Aerithea, but some of them are too big. Like this one, I like it, but it's a little bit grande. This one is too big in the back, so it's okay. If, I mean, if these are your style, that's great. Like, and when I see them on other people, they look so good. And then when I try them on me, I don't like it. You know how that is. It's just like how it is in real life. So, anywho. Do, do, do. Yeah, that one is cute, but it's too big. I do have this one because I love the bangs over the eyes. I was never really a huge bang fan, but I love how it covers the face and the eyebrows because sometimes I don't like the color of the eyebrows on the faces I choose, and so I like to cover them up, just like with this one. This one's kind of cute, but it's not all that. Um, this one is way too big. No, thank you. Okay, so it's obvious for me I like pink and blonde. This one is cute, but I think it's a little bit too bright pink. Um, and then I do have this. It's like a cute braided bun. I love the high buns. I think it's a cute style. So I love that one. I do have these pigtails also. It's okay, except the forehead goes down really low. This one is a winner. Like, this one is always good. That one is just definitely always good. And this big bun with the bangs in the front is good. So this is one that I have. I love this one. I love the bangs in the front. It's nice and wispy. It's one of my favorites. So that is where we are going to stop it today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe if you did. And turn those notifications on for future videos. Thanks, guys. Ciao.